Hello everyone. Here we have got a logarithmic equation to solve. In this equation, the variable occurs both in the argument as well as in the base of the log. So we need to be careful in the solution that neither the argument nor the base becomes negative. So let us proceed to see that how do we solve this equation. First, we make use of the multi multiplication property of the log, which gives the equation as log of 2x plus 3 into x plus 5 to the base x plus 3 becoming equal to 2. Now we make use of the definition of log to get the value of 2x plus 3 into x plus 5 as equal to x plus 3 raised to the power 2. Now we multiply the left hand side to get it as 2x square plus 10x plus 3x plus 15. Expanding the right hand side gives x square plus 6x plus 9. Now we take all the terms on the left hand side and simplify the equation to get x square plus 7x plus 6 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation and must be having two solutions. So to solve this equation we start factorizing and we write it as x square plus 6x plus x plus 6 is equal to 0. We take x common from the first two terms to get x into x plus 6 and we leave the other two terms as x plus 6 which becomes equal to 0. Now we take x plus 6 common to get x plus 6 into x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now either x plus 6 or x plus 1 must be equal to 0. So for x plus 6 is equal to 0, we get x is equal to minus 6. But x is equal to minus 6 will not be a valid solution as it will make the base of log negative in the original equation. That is x plus 3 would become equal to minus 3 and the equation itself will not remain valid. So we turn to the other solution that is x plus 1 is equal to 0. It gives x is equal to minus 1 and we find that this is the only valid solution of the given equation. Thanks for watching.